Hi this, hi, this is Jay here with jaysonlinereviews.com. I'm going to read a little article I wrote. It's geared towards beginners who are trying to rank, get their blogs or articles or websites to rank on the top pages of Google's, top pages of Google, um, Yahoo, or Bing. I'm going to start off here by reading, and you, can, you guys can just sit back, relax. I'm just going to read this to you. So you have probably just started your new website or blog and do not know the first thing about getting targeted traffic through pro proper search engine optimization. Having a website or blog online is your little piece of internet real estate that no one can control but you. If you are in it for the long haul and you are looking into blogging, I would highly suggest a self-hosted WordPress.org blog. The free blogging platforms like Blogger can be, de can be deleted by Google and all your hard work will be flushed down the virtual toilet. Trust me when I say this, I have been there and done that and it's definitely no fun. Enough of the small talk, let's get down to business. Here is how to drive free targeted traffic to Google, Yahoo and Bing from the search engines using some simple search engine optimization techniques. If your website or blog is not getting any free targeted traffic from proper search engine optimization, then how in the world are you supposed to make any money from your new internet business? And who wants to pay for traffic if they can't help it? Not me. And I'm sure you would answer the same way. Paying for traffic via the pay-per-click methods is a temporary fix to running an online business. Search engine optimization is a free strategy that can have targeted visitors to your site in minutes with proper keyword research. At least when you are first starting out online and you do not have hundreds if not thousands of dollars to hand over to Google, Google has enough money. Why make their pockets even fatter if you do, if you do not have to? They do not want your site to be getting a bunch of free traffic from the search engines. Why? Because they want you to, you to be dumb and run pay-per-click campaigns to make their pockets even fatter. Google is only worth billions and billions of dollars, are you? It is time the small business owner gets a break, and that is why learning proper search engine optimization techniques is crucial if you want to make a lot of money from your online business. But you have a little problem. You do not, you do not know anything about basic search engine optimization, so you can drive this free targeted traffic to your new website or blog, so customers can buy your merchandise, whether it be digital, which is information, or actual physical products like Amazon for example or you may produce your own goods or services that you are selling for yourself for example either way you cut it you need laser targeted SEO traffic to make a, to make a considerable amount of money online the internet is a numbers game the people that are doing well online or online business businesses for example know how to drive targeted traffic to their sites that will crash some servers the internet can be brutal, especially in a, in a competitive niche like the affiliate marketing or make money online or the internet marketing niches, just to name a few of the many competitive niches out there in the internet marketing world. Traffic is the lifeblood of any online business and it will determine if a business is a success or not. If you are able to bring targeted traffic to your website or blog, then you will make a lot of money. If you cannot, then you might as well pack it up and put in more hours at your stable 9 to 5 job. I cannot even stress enough how crucial how crucial search engine optimization really is for a long-lasting viable business. Learning and training in at least basic search engine optimization tactics is more important now than it, than it ever has been. Unless your blog or website is based around underwater basket weaving with little to no competition, you're going to need to know a few pointers so you can compete in the new SEO game and turn your pe your personal online real estate into a money making machine or your personal ATM machine. You're going to need to know how to get your blog posts or your website content to the top of the major search engines, meaning page one for, for your keyword terms that you are targeting. For you to drive targeted cash in hand SEO visitors who are actively searching for what you have to offer. Free traffic is the best kind of traffic and that's what search engine optimization can bring to the table very quickly. Cool fact, 90% of all online searchers click on the natural organic free listings when performing a search online. Only 10% click on the paid listings. For beginners, these are on the right hand side of the Google search engine. Those are all the paid ads that are on the right hand side. 
Here are a few SEO tips that are aimed more towards beginners that will give you a basic understanding of what's going on with search engine optimization and how can you and how you can get the most out of it to rise up the rankings in the search engines fast. Your first tip, research keyword phrases related to your website or blog that potential visitors will be looking for related to your site. I use the Google AdWords keyword research tool. It is free and it is the best online in my opinion. You can use the exact phrase function. It will tell you exactly how many searches are being performed on a monthly basis for whatever keyword phrase that you that you type into it. If you see articles on the top pages of whatever particular phrase you are trying to rank for, that is a good sign you could potentially beat them out with your search engine optimization techniques. SEO tip. If you see a lot of paid ads when doing a search, this is a good sign that your keyword phrase is profitable. Tip number two. Think highly search keyword phrases with low competition. This may re require some research on your part, but it will pay off big time when done correctly. Your goal is to find lucrative phrases that people will type into the major search engines that will lead them to your site. Make sure the competition is low and if you see articles ranked on the first pages this could be a good phrase to optimize your site for. You do not want to go after phrases like make money online if that is your niche that will take years for you to climb up the rankings for example. Be smart and go after phrases that you can rank on the first pages with with little effort on your part. Long tail keyword phrases work the best. Four or more words. Tip number three. Make a list of four to five phrases that fit this criteria and optimize your website or blog with these keywords. This does not mean stuffing your content with all your keywords keyword so that your content doesn't even read properly. It means after you find a good list of keywords to go after from the search engines, you are going to want to add those keywords into the text of your site or blog. Write posts with these keywords as titles, for example, and then spread keywords in your text moderately and make sure your text is readable for your visitors. Readers first, search engines second should be your main goal. Meta tags. These are the tags that are on the top of your blog or website in the header section. My meta, ta meta tags are an entrepreneur's journey to earn you more money online, affiliate marketing lessons, product reviews, traffic tips. These are the words that show up when, a, when you are visiting a site at the very top address bar directly above it, directly above whatever website or blog you're visiting. This is the title of my blog and these keywords are also my meta tags. These are a few of the keywords I am going after in the search engines. Meta tags are absolutely essential, so make sure you have them added and your keywords are in your, are in your meta tags prominently. Meta tags alone can do wonders, but don't expect no miracles, especially if you are in a very competitive niche, but they do help out a great deal, so use them wisely. If you are using a hosted WordPress blog, there is a section in there where you can add meta tags. These are extremely important if you're not using them. Your blog will not be indexed properly and you will fall down the rankings like the slide on the old shoots and ladders game. If you're still confused on how to add them to a if you're still confused on how to add them, do a search on Google, how to add meta tags to my blog or website. This will guide you through the process. Tip number five. If you have not started your own blog or website yet, then make sure you pick a short domain name with the keywords that you are targeting in your domain name. This will make it easier for people to remember your site and it will give you a nice boost in the search engine rankings. Having your keywords in your domain name is a great search engine optimization tip that all beginners should take advantage of if they have not picked a domain name for their new site yet. Tip number six. Build relevant backlinks for proper SEO. This is even more important if your niche is extremely competitive like mine is. You want to link to sites with high page rank if possible, if possible that are directly related to your blog or website for proper search engine optimization. He or she with the most quality relevant backlinks usually wins the SEO wars. Are you prepared to go to combat for your first page rankings on Google? You should be. It can pay off big time for years to come without an adverse effect on your pocketbook. SEO is based around free traffic. It does take some time on your part, but at least your money will, will be where it belongs, in your wallets and purses. I hope you enjoyed this free training tutorial on search engine optimization. There is a lot more intangibles to SEO 
but this training will at least get you started on your way to getting some free traffic that will last forever. As always, to your online success and cheers to your long-lasting free search engine optimization traffic, Jay. And if you need more tips on SEO and you want to read this article in its entirety and a lot more articles just like it, click on the link right, be right below this video in the description and there will be a link to my to my blog where you can read a lot more articles that are based around SEO, internet marketing, affiliate marketing, and product reviews. I pretty much cover it all, but thanks for listening and I hope this article helps you out a great deal. Take care.